Welcome everyone. The palace construction is finally finished and this is our beautiful palace in the desert and yeah it's actually so cool that we have no bees. It is really 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 great and what I actually plan on doing is so we have like one bee nest here right. Let's add actually another one and put it maybe on this cherry tree right here. So we are quickly going to grab a beehive from this chest here and like we could place it here or I think here. Here is better though in my opinion. So we're gonna place it on this side here. So yeah, once once we have like more bees, they will actually move here. Let's quickly grab two flowers. Uh. I have to place down the boat for a moment. We'll grab it in a moment. And yeah, here's one bee. We need um, another one. Where's the other one? Hello? Come out, please. And yeah, once we have enough bees, I'm actually going to move some bees over to this direction where those cherry trees are. We're going to have a big glass house here, actually, with like multiple bees. And yeah, while, while the bees are doing whatever, we're actually going to quickly add the first professions here for the villagers. So this small side room here that connects with our main uh, palace room. So I've decided to here add the weaponsmith. So I've already two grindstones that I've prepared and one grindstone will be here in this corner, one will be here. And we are going to put stairs around the grindstone. And maybe we're gonna add a third grindstone here even. And on this side, there will be a sitting area. So we are going to add two seats, two will be here. Then in the middle, there will be a fence. And on top of the fence for tablecloth, we are going to place some yellow carpet. Oh, I think that doesn't look too bad, right? And yeah, did finally two bees come out? Okay, we got one here. Where's the other one? Wait, what happened? We still have... I hope we still have two bees. No, actually we should have three. I bred them one time last night. It's kind of weird. And yeah, all the windows here now have freaking trap doors as window shutters. We have those stairs. And... Only this window is missing still. We're gonna do this later and... Where the heck is the second bee? Even a cat walked in here, what the heck? Like I've noticed that like a lot of beings are coming here. We see like villagers scout this area. Now we have even a cat here. And maybe we get some squirrels soon if they only existed. Yo, why don't we have freaking squirrels in Minecraft? I think that would be such a ni nice addition, right, to the game. Like, imagine we had actually squirrels in this game. And yeah, what I plan on doing here is uh, when we enter, I'm going to have some red carpet leading to a throne. The throne will be here and... Let me show you the upstairs area. So upstairs I already did some room separation. That means we have here one room. We have one here in the middle. And one here on this side. And what we really need now is especially because we have now also the, the grindstones. We need a bunch of beds. So what we're gonna do now is we're gonna add a few beds. And color wise, hmm, let me think what color should we use. I think we should go for something like perhaps lime, lime colored beds. Okay, I will put the first bed in the corner and we are going to quickly grab some dye. I think lime color is nice. And are there finally two bees? I'm actually worried because like I do hear some sounds that there's a bee inside or something, right? But it never comes out. It's almost freaking night. Yeah, I, I will do this later and... <laughs> okay, I didn't, I didn't mean to do this, but we just caught a freaking cat and now it's in the boat. 
You can actually tempt this so easily now. Look, it's trying to escape, but it's stuck. I need lime dye and just one. Yeah, I, I'll keep the door open like that and I will have a look in the morning and see if anything has changed. Let's quickly sleep if we can. We cannot. Wow. That's actually such a massive building, isn't it? I freaking love the way our new palace look like. Like, this is the best building so far that we've built. Like, just look at it. It looks so, so majestic. Finally, we can sleep. Now, lime die, lime die, lime die. Where is lime die? Okay, no problem. We can use some green dye together with some white dye and just make lime dye ourselves. So yeah, how do you get a uh, lime dye? All you need is some bone meal, you turn this into white dye and you just mix it up like that and we have lime dye. It's just one bee left. Are you kidding me? That means we need to use our, our nether hub to get more bees. No, there's two bees. This sound, this sound doesn't happen if there's not a bee. Hmm. I don't have a campfire right now with me. I want to actually collect some 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 honeycomb. But yeah, let's go to the bedroom quickly. I'm so excited about this project. Like we have a population of at least like 12 villagers or more inside this palace. Let's make also a second bed. And we can try to breed the villagers to see if we can get some more. That also find here about the bed that we have. So I've already mentioned it in the previous episode. I actually want to put the bell perhaps into the garden here somewhere. But yeah, about, about the throne room, there's something I also need to add, so it's like more realistic. So buildings, if they have like super large rooms, and we see this with uh, garages quite often, they usually come with pillars to stabilize everything, right? Uh, if you want to have something that's realistic, we also need to look at upstairs. So upstairs we have multiple rooms, right? So this wall here actually stabilizes, let's say, this floor, like this roof, this floor here, right? So yeah, we have to do the same downstairs and how are we gonna find out where the middle is just gonna make a hole here and we're gonna keep a space of two blocks here and there will be some red at the bottom here and yeah okay oh wait I actually I actually wanted the other way um, so here will be the chiseled one, then there will be the red one, sorry, and here the red one too. And one of those torches we can break now and put there. There will be another one, it will be here. Okay, also break this torch. That looks actually really nice. I kind of like those pillars. Wow. And yeah, we can patch this now up. Already know where it is. And this is just one block behind the window, so. <laughs> this cat. Should we tame it? Thinking now if we should tame it. Ah, I messed up. Torch here too. Torch here too. Wow, this is so spacious. Like, we can put actually quite a lot of stuff here. Like, here I already want to have a large dining place. It's like this super long table here. So 
so this is where we place it. Nice. And about the sitting area, do we have enough fence? I just have four. No, that's not gonna be enough. We have to gra grab some more fence. Let's put already some of the tablecloth here. Wait, what did I just do? It's by accident. Now... Yeah, th those bees, like something's wrong. I always see just one outside. Now, where's the crafting table? Here it is. We need at least around... I think like 14 fence. I need more sticks. <laughs> oh, llamas. So many llamas now, it's actually crazy. I, what I wanted to do is... Maybe move some of the llamas into our freaking palace. Or perhaps the camels. Like I want to have some 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 more creatures in our garden. Yo, that's weird. There's always just one. <gasps> there are two! Ah I missed this one by one second. By the way, I'm going to use two red flowers. It's, it's more simple. So yeah, when does this one come out? Please, where's the other one? Uh, okay, I'll check back in later. <laughs> I just want to breed the freaking bees. Like, come on. How can this be so difficult? Okay, one sitting area here. How the coordinates? This is one block from. We could extend this and have here even more seats, but I don't want to overdo it because it could still like fit in other stuff. Like we can have like, like a little kitchen area, for example. What else we could do is, we could perhaps add like a couple of bookshelves and stuff. Yeah, there's just so much we could add. I, I love the way like this uh, building starts to look and those pillars were actually such a great idea. Not only is this more realistic because it stabilizes the, the floor and everything, right? From the first floor. But besides that, like, it definitely adds to it. Now, how was this? This was like one block before the pillar line, okay. It's correct here. Let's eat something. <laughs> like I love the, the eating sound actually in Minecraft. It's just so so interesting. Like quick 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 quick. <laughs> Alright. So this sitting area is done as well. What we could do here, for example, also in this room, have a bunch of trapdoors but maybe some nice paintings as well and you know what i'm just about to do that so we're going to quickly get a few trapdoors and some paintings at least two but for paintings if i'm not mistaken we need some sticks as well painting where are you here two and a bunch of trapdoors Yeah, those are enough. About the throne room. We could we could add some gold blocks in addition. Like, I actually have this idea, but we have to see if we have enough gold. Otherwise, I'm just going to farm some more. Perhaps even in the nether. And we can make, like, the throne partially out of gold. Maybe some quartz or something. I think that could look really, really nice. Okay, so here are the trapdoors, then the paintings. One painting will be here. Ooh, that's a nice one. That's the one with the skull. 
here there will be a two block one like this nice yo this really adds to it about this corner either another grindstone you know what yeah 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 i want this actually So there will be stairs and the corner will be a grindstone here there will be some flowers two block flowers so what we're quickly gonna do is we're gonna get two more grindstones i should have um stone slab somewhere in one of the chests here where did i put it Here it is. Ah, it's almost freaking night. Let's quickly sleep and make the grindstones. Yo, we have done really well with like some of those buildings. Like this one here looks really, really nice. Good morning, villager. How was your sleep? You were snoring so much, dude. Like, I could barely sleep because of the sounds you made. Dude, you need to stop snoring when you're sleeping. It's just so annoying. <laughs> um, yeah. Do we need anything else right now? I don't think we need anything else right now. The armor will be what we are working on next. And... I've already said it, right? So the armor will be on this side. And before the bees now leave, I will quickly make sure this one's here. And I have a brilliant idea. I'm smart actually. So I put this one on a lead. And why cannot attach it here? What the heck? Just gonna use one of those fences then. So yeah, this one will be here. And ooh! Okay, it's no more necessary actually. The second bee is out. I'm just going to... Wait. There it is. Please breed. Ah, the population is safe. Okay, we have a baby bee. That's good. I hope soon they move into this nest. Would be perfect. I would actually keep this boat here with the cat. Because I'm not sure if we have this color yet. Maybe I'm going to tame it later. Okay, more bees is good. Wait, where do they want to fly? Or did actually one escape previously through the door because I kept it opened? I have to be careful with that. About those, which, which flowers are we gonna place there? I'm getting rose bushes. Rose, rose, rose. What are, what are they detecting there anyway? Now, do we have any rose bushes left here? No. Bone meal, bone meal, bone meal, bone meal, bone meal, bone meal. so noisy the cats okay we need two rose bushes one two let's get three doesn't matter one rose bush will be in the garden additionally and it's going to be yeah nice And the other two go inside this building. Now here two rose bushes. And what did I press? I, I keep pressing something by accident. I'm sorry, guys. Ah, I can't do this because the trap door. I have to remove it. And yeah, it's like a trap door like this. That's nice. Wow like that 
this grindstone will be here. So we have one, two, three. We have four freaking uh, weaponsmiths now. This is perfect. Wow. Let me actually take a picture with this room. I, I feel like this room turned out pretty well, right? What do you guys think? I think it's nice. It's small, but it's still like quite cozy, right? Especially with the sitting area here, the flowers. But yeah, next time we are going to work on the Amora side. And this will be this side here. And there will be either three or four armorers, maybe also four just like we have with the weaponsmith, so just the numbers like equal, right? Yeah, I think four armorers is good, plus we can get like a lot of cool like pieces. Like everything we are wearing right now is in fact actually from an armorer of another project that we leveled up. And sometimes we get we got like good pieces. Like this one here is not too bad, the chest piece. We have protection 2 and unbreaking 2. It's not the best in the world, but it's decent. We got here projectile protection 3 and unbreaking 2. And I actually had a better helmet before where we could like breathe, uh, breathe underwater actually quite long. But we lost this one because it broke over time. But yeah guys, that's it for today's episode. I hope you guys enjoyed this one. And if you guys are new to this channel, please don't forget to hit that subscribe button for more content. If you guys enjoyed today's episode, please don't forget to give this one a thumbs up. And I will see you guys next time.